Hey everybody, this is Jake. Just really quickly wanted to do a short video to explain this .alp file format. It's just like a .zip file or a .rar file, except it's Ableton's proprietary format for sharing sessions. And that's what we're gonna use to deliver all of the session files you're going to need while you're working along with us on these videos, okay? So before you press this play button here, go ahead and click, please download this session file. It's going to take you to a box.com download link and you're gonna go ahead and just download this session file. And once you've downloaded that, okay, wherever that has downloaded to, you're gonna go ahead and click to open that and it should, if you don't already have Ableton open, it should open Ableton for you. Um, and what's gonna do is it's gonna say preparing for installation here in this Ableton pop-up dialog and it's gonna open a little finder pop-up dialog box. And I'm gonna go ahead and go into my music folder here and create a new folder. And you can put this on your desktop if you want. I'm gonna put it in my music folder just called live and maybe one called Ableton online. And basically once I click open, it's going to unpack that ALP and open that and put that in that folder. And it's gonna put that project folder wherever I told Ableton to open that session. Now all I have to do is just double click to open that session file and I'm with the program now and I'm ready to go and I can go ahead and use that session file and work along with the video. So I'm ready to click play now. And that's how you use our ALPs and download ALPs and work along with us. Thanks a lot guys, see you in the first video.